And the National Assembly is demanding a special prosecution into the allegations, with even the ruling party standing firm on the need for a special probe. Its launch is all but guaranteed in the near future. Park ji has this report. The ruling Senori party has decided to accept a call by the main opposition Democratic Party to put a special prosecutor on the Choi Soon-sil case following a general meeting of its lawmakers on Wednesday afternoon. The ruling party itself is also demanding that all officials related to the case at the cabinet and presidential office be held responsible and be, quote, reshuffled. Floor leader Chang Jin Sub demanded that the presidential office find Choi Soon Hill and her daughter and bring them back to Korea for questioning. We will have Choi Soon Hill brought back to Korea and will make her stand in the photo line at the prosecutor's office. We urge the presidential office to immediately order the repatriation of Choi and her family. The main opposition Democratic Party welcomed the ruling party's acceptance of the special prosecutor, saying that while it comes late, the Senori Party has finally humbled itself before the public. The Liberal Party vowed to dig into the case, adding that no one is exempt from investigation. The party also said if the allegations are true, it would be shocking for the top office to have been under such strong influence from someone with so close to the president. What is really serious is that the president didn't just take Che's advice in private, but a group of people around Che interfered in state issues, acting like an advisory panel, and the president actually accepted the advice. If it's true, it's like Che ran her own presidential office above the real one. It's total nonsense. However, the minor opposition People's Party expressed concern about the appointment of a special prosecutor, saying they won't bring out the truth because, according to the Constitution, the president herself cannot be investigated over the matter. The party's interim leader, Park Ji-won, said the ruling party only accepted the special prosecutor to protect the president, demanding that the president herself come forward to the public on the matter. Che reportedly received all the details of the president's schedule and state affairs, and even made decisions on personnel appointments. It's just confusing who the real president is. And the Assembly's House Steering Committee has decided to ask prosecutors to charge senior presidential secretary Wu byung with violating a parliamentary law requiring him to appear at last week's audit. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.